My name is Isabel Salas. My name is Damale Britton. Hi, my name is Catherine Weiss. Jose Lemus. Karina McCormick. I'm Karen Lamb. My name is Sakina. Laura Virgil. Linda London. My name is Lindsay Limbach. My name is Kathy Lohmeyer. It kind of just changes your life when you realize you're a person who can be involved in a movement that does something. Four years ago, residents in this neighborhood have been talking to each other, going door to door, figuring out what we can do to improve our homes and our neighborhoods. Our renters and we deserve respect and dignity and sustainable steady healthy housing for ourselves and our families. We need to do something so that everyone has a place to live and enough food to eat. Some of you are familiar with our crazy business model that says that we feed everyone whether they can pay or not. I have always seen my cooking and baking as an extension of ministry even before I was in the ministry. My daughter and I attended the last community builder workshop, so that really started the wheels moving of, ooh, this, you know, what, what's possible. It sounds a little bit um, insignificant or unproductive to be educating yourself, but that power of knowledge is so, so significant when you're in a room of people who expect you to not speak the same language as you. What can we do within our own neighborhoods in order to make things happen? It's not going to happen overnight, um, and that's something that's hard for me to swallow. But it, I mean, it does take time, and it takes community to do that. Is the need for affordable and quality housing something that's an issue for you or the people in your community? The reason we ask is because we've been going door to door, we've heard from so many folks. Um, and we also know that the city of Lincoln has acknowledged that we are 5,000 affordable housing units short. And that what is currently affordable can be dangerous, unsafe, and unhealthy. So would that be something you'd be willing to help us with? I would like you guys to please do something about this. Um, that, that also is just as effective as showing up. Um, so yeah, I can just leave you a phone number, and this, this again is the, the number that goes straight to the city council. Whatever local activists have in mind in a city like Lincoln, I want them to know that if they stick to it and they organize and they're focused, that they actually can make the changes they want happen. <laughs> oh, I'm nervous. I can feel it. Okay. I'm here because I live in the near south area of Lincoln, where the population is dense and the rental property is even denser. I walk my neighborhood. Everyone should walk their neighborhoods. You see a lot more of your city when you walk the neighborhood. You know what? Renters have a right to a habitable living space. From 2013 to 2016, the medium net worth of a homeowner was $231,000. The medium net worth of a renter, which was going down, was $5,200. 
so they need us. They need us to be advocates for them because they don't have the power that money sometimes gives in government. We have to come together as a city and do all that we can so that our most vulnerable residents don't have to make the decision between dignity and quality affordable housing.